Oops. Okay. <clears throat> Today I'm going to demonstrate a split. I'm going to show you actually how to get into the split. So, the split I'm going to show today, it's, um, I call it the, it's called a modified middle split. That is what I call it, a modified middle split. Alright? So it's a combination of a straddle and uh, um, middle split. So one leg is going into a straddle, the other one is going into a middle. So it's like, uh, you know, it's like an advanced kind of version of it. So I'm going to show you how to get into it. That is stuff to do, the small stretches to actually get into it. Okay? Um, stretching is very important. Remember that. That before you do any workout and after, you always want to stretch. And you want to warm down with stretching also after you finish your workout. And remember that um, <coughs> you always want to. Like when you're going to work out, you always want to make sure you do some sort of jump rope or even small short jog. Not anything like a full burst of a workout, but like a small jog or a little jump rope just to get a little sweat going to get your muscles and tendons and everything to warm up. You don't want to do cold stretching because that's where you, you're going to injure yourself like that. So you want to get a small, you know, jog small joint rope, even walking around a little bit, get a little sweat going before you actually get into a full stretching. Alright, so I already warmed up already with some joint rope, push-ups, squats and stuff like that. If you start off with some regular knees straight out, you're going to push your hips going backwards, push your butt going out, kind of stretching not with your back but with your, your hips and your hamstring. You want to come straight down. Just touch your palm to the ground. This is a good stretch. Stretch with your hamstring. You know, straighten your knees. But make, sure you make, make sure your knees are not bent. Come here. You know, nice little stretch. You know, try to come down. Put yourself in as far as possible. Nice and slowly. Just turn it to your left. Try to come down. Try to touch your palm to your, your forehead to your knee. Touch palm to the ground. Come to the next side. Turn. Repeat the same thing. I'm gonna go through these pretty quickly. All right. So let's come here. Try to touch palm to the ground. Touch your forehead to the moon. Right, come up to the center. Get more of a wider stretch here. Try to come down as far as possible. Come down. Try to touch your your um, elbows to the floor. Here, try to come back, put yourself coming down. You want to come as far as you can underneath. Put yourself as far as you can down until you can actually even reach your head underneath. And just pull yourself down forward all the way as far as you can. You want to get that kind of stretching going on here. You can come all the way down. Get that hamstring nice and loose now. Alright? Okay, next one you can do here. Bring your knees in as far as you can. You want to keep the knee flat down now, all the way down. You want to have it. You want to have it popping up like this. You want to keep it flat down. Okay. Same thing. You want to stretch with your hips, with your lower self back. Bring it forward. You want to come deep down into the stretch. Come deep down. Trying to grab your toes. Make sure your knees are straight. Trying to pull the foot up to get that knee nice and straight. Come down. Touch forehead to the knee. And touch chin to the knee, get that nice stretch, grab your toes, pull yourself down, hold it for a couple minutes. You know, a couple of minutes is good. Transition to the other side. Repeat the same thing, bring that leg, tuck it in. Come here, turn it back, trying to get as straight as possible. Turn here, now as straight as possible. Here, the same thing, repeat. Stretch forward. You want to come deep down into the stretch. Grab here. Pull yourself down as far as you can. Touch your head to your knee. Forehead to the knee, chin. Feel that stretch. In here. If you can't come all the way down, as long as you can come here is good. Just try to get them as far as you can. 
try to reach for your toes, touch your toes, you know. Try to just come down and try to get your forehead to your knee. Try to keep this knee flat also. Make sure it's not up. Alright? Breathe it in. Regular. Butterfly. Same thing. You want to come down. Place the elbows. Press down as far as you can. As far as you can get it down. As far as you can. As far as you can. You can flop it just like this. You know, pull it in. Flop it. Just like this. Flop, 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 flop. Press down. Try to get them down. Touching the ground. As far as you can. Reach yourself forward, down, here, try to pull yourself down, nice and slowly, touch forehead, take toes, up back, down, here, want to come here now, come like this, go on your knees here, come down, sit down a half stretch, right, want to push yourself coming forward again, the knee back, same thing, Everything you want to come forward down, touch on um, your chin to your knee, come down if you can, go for a, a bigger stretch, touch forward to the floor, if you can, come down, touch your, your um, chest to the floor, if you can get here, it's just to get you really stretched out, get a hamstring nice, get the groin nice, everything nice and stretched out, doctors, everything, all those muscles, get them nice and stretched out. I'm going to switch to the other side now, you just jump, cross, the other side, come down, same exact thing, here, bring your knee in, same thing, I'm going to come down into the stretch, come down, straighten up, and pull yourself down all the way, keep that knee nice and flat, come down, 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 put your chin to your knee, forehead, and you get that big stretch from here, Come down, try to touch your chest and floor. Here, nice and good stretch. Here. Alright, this is the next one you can do. Here, you want to bend your knees here, put this foot like in a straddle. Not in a straddle, but in a uh, middle, and just come down and stretch. You want to come bend knees all the way down as far as you can. You want to get that stretch. You want to feel a little pressure in your hips, maybe in your knees, but try to go as far as you can and get that stretch inside. Switch to the other side. Come as low as you can. Try to get that stretch inside. You can feel it. Sometimes when you're growing hips, knees. Repeat that side again. Now what I want you to do now I want you just to flip this leg over, like, just like that. Try to use any hands, but if you can't manage without any hands, then you know just use your hands here. Get that nice stretch. Then I go to the other side here. Come back down into that uh, middle. You're gonna flip over. Same way. There. Okay. Feel that nice stretch. What this does is loosen up your hips a little more. Because then you're rotating in the air kind of. From rotating, transitioning from from um, middle, and you're going up to your heel. So you're gonna feel a little more tugging in your hips from here. One more time, come here. To use your hands, you know, so you want to keep this leg, everything you want to keep nice and straight. To use your hands, you put your hands down and you just rotate over. Keep your foot flat and rotate over, just like this. Bam. Alright? Then all I want you to do now is to do this. Come here, side to side. Fold your hands here. I want you to come side to side. Keep a low, low level stance, here, side to side, just like this, side to side, just like this, no hands, side to side, side to side, low stance, feel that stretch, keep everything nice and straight up, everything should be nice and straight, nice and straight locked up, 
Okay? You hear it, right? Just like how you're going to do a middle or a side split or which of us you're going to do, you put your hands down. You're going to go to my left side, point my toes going straight up. So this is straddle on this side and this is um, middle here. Okay? So I'm going to slide down. When I'm sliding down, I'm keeping everything nice and straight. Everything is straight when I'm sliding out. I'm not trying to keep my knees bent or nothing. So you're coming down with everything already straight. Okay? So this is the modified middle split. Okay? It's a combination of a straddle and a middle. So I'm here. Everything is nice and locked up. Now from here you want to do some work. You want to come down. You want to try to touch your chin to your knee or forehead. Try to come into the floor. Get a nice chin stretch. Touch your chin to the ground. Same thing, here, nice stretch, put your hands over just like you do in the middle, stretch. Keep that leg nice and locked out, here, nice stretch here, alright. You're going to switch to the other side now. So what you do, you just pop over here, switch rotation. So you're going into the middle on this side now, and you're going to a straddle on that side. Come back down, you're going to slide straight down into it, nice and easy, nice and easy into it. Boom, alright, so you're here, nice and easy, come down, same thing, touch chin to knee, forehead, come down, try to touch, put your hand here, try to come forward into it, nice stretch, keep that knee nice and bent. I mean, nice and straight, I mean, sorry. Keep that knee nice and straight out. Just like nice and straight and get that stretch. Feel that stretch in there. And come up. Boom. Then you can repeat in a different fashion. So now you kind of warm up a little bit now. So you can repeat again. So you come in here. Nice and easy. Boom, repeat. One side. Nice stretch. Come up. Boom, here, repeat, this side, nice and easy, lock out the hips, lock out the knees, and come down, boom, and then you can just, and then you can just rotate, over to over, rotate, over, rotate, Let's give you a deeper stretch, rotate, over, rotate, over, and rotate, over. Give you a deeper, deeper stretch. Okay? Down. And up. You guys remember, always warm up first before you do these. This is very important. Always get a little jogging, a little jump rope, walking, squats, jumping jacks. Something to get your blood going, get your blood flowing, get a little sweat going, get your muscles nice and warm. Alright, this is very hard. It's going to take a little while to learn this, so practice the basic stretching that I show you first. Like small stretches, you want to get the hips nice and loosened up, hamstrings, everything nice and loosened up. Once you get those loose, then you should be fine. You should be able to fall down into it. Practice this slowly. Um, and remember, it's very important. Flexibility in the martial arts is very important. Flexibility is important in any kind of activity, any sport, anything that you're doing that could be from walking, jogging, flexibility is very important. You always want to stretch first. That is why I always stretch before I do any kind of activity. Playing basketball, anything, I always do stretching. I always do full range. But if I don't do full range, I do half stretching. Okay, you guys can comment, rate this channel, uh, subscribe, check out WayneKitchen.com and keep on stretching, keep on kicking. Oops.